Quarter-final action kicked off at the Western and Southern Open on Friday with Jean-Julien Roger and Oreo Takao taking on Jamie Murray and Bruno Suarez. The number three seeds took advantage of an early break and soon found themselves a set to the good. Roger and Takao turned defence into attack in the second. In the end, it was the Dutch-Romanian pairing that would complete the upset and continue their quest for a second Masters 1000 Series title of the year. The second match of the day saw top seeds Pierre Hugues Herbert and Nicola Mahu take on Daniel Nasta and Vasek Pospisil. Some early mistakes by the Canadians would see the French side with a chance to take the opening set. Herbert wouldn't suffer the same fate and was able to put the top doubles pairing up a set. Nesta and Pospisil got back on track in the second and started to find the cracks in the French defence. Yeah. Herbert and Mahou used some aggressive net play to keep the set close. It would be the sixth seeds to break at the most opportune of times and push the top side to a match tie break. All the pieces seem to fall into place for the Canadian duo throughout the tie break. And a timely ace from Pospisil would see them complete the upset and book their place in Saturday's semi final. On centre court, Ivan Dodig and Marcelo Melo faced off against Raven Klaassen and Rajiv Ram, with the Croatian-Brazilian pairing making the most of their chances. It proved a tightly contested set that would require a tiebreak to decide. Game and first set, Dodig Melo. The number four seeds continued to apply pressure in the second. Game. But Klaassen and Ram wouldn't give up without a fight. Dodding and Mello proved too much to handle in the end as they took the set and the match. Game, seven match. Dodding and Mello, just set so long, seven, six, seven, five.
The last quarter final of the day saw Trent Huey and Max Meany facing off with Bob and Mike Bryan. The Bryans seemed determined to prove to the American crowd that they were still at their dominant best by taking the first set 6-4. The hometown favourites picked up where they left off early in the second. However, Huey and Mirny weren't ready to throw in the towel just yet. A back and forth second set saw both teams pull out all the stops to win points. Second set tiebreak would go the Bryans' way and see the brothers through to the semi-finals.